Hey everybody, one of Weezem here, 345 AM. We just wrapped up the Mushroom Cup 50cc part one of our Mario Kart Wii U blind play. I guess Mario Kart 8 blind playthrough for the Wii U. Uh, let everything get processed there. Uh, we left off on the screen the music very jubilant Saturday night live-ish, if you will. Gonna come back to single player. Uh, we're obviously gonna go back to Grand Prix. 50cc, as you can see, the Mushroom Cup, the trophies there, we got the three stars, so that's going to be how they kind of structure that. Uh, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So I'm not quite sure what order they're going to go in. I think what I'm going to do... Okay, well first we'll see what we unlock. So uh, The character roster just went from a 4x4 four four square to a 5x5. Five five. So here we go. Alright, we got Lemmy. That's going to be cool. Uh, that's neat. Ooh, I didn't mean to select him. Well, hmm. got several options here. <laughs> we can either do my standard stuff, or we can, uh, roll with it. You know what? Let's just roll with it. The game gave it to us. We're gonna call it good. Uh, that way, if I bomb, we can blame it on Lemmy. So, um, I've never raced this guy. Obviously, no one has at this point, unless you played the game, because he just appeared in Mario Kart 8. Um, oh, sweet. All right, this is awesome. I'm gonna go ahead and do the flower cup. If I find out that they like ordered it where Shell would be next in line somehow. Uh, I'll come in and correct that, but uh, obviously the top row is going to be like your new cups. Um, ew, this looks awesome. Uh, then the bottom, of course, is all retro, but we're going to do Flower Cup 50cc here. Actually, let me back up. We got Mario Circuit, Toad Harbor, Twisted Mansion, and Shy Guy Falls. It's going to be sweet. Mario Circuit looks kind of like a newly designed classic, if you will, and I'm not saying it's a throwback, but, you know, it's tracks we've seen, and Peach's Castle looks to be in the mix, or some, something that looks like Peach's Castle. Uh, actually, that looks smaller than her castle, but nonetheless, um, should be cool. Toad Harbor looks like it might be a busy town. I think that's where the Luigi uh, trolley car was on the GameStop poster. Twisted Mansion, I always love the haunted tracks. Shy Guy Falls, that kind of looks like a uh, Mario Kart 8 version of maybe Koopa Cape, which I loved. So let's go ahead and uh, experience this firsthand. I have never raced as Iggy. I'm guessing uh, he is going to be a lightweight character. So who knows what will happen. But um, we'll, we'll roll with it, like I said, and make the most of it. Oh, awesome. Yeah, that is Peach's Castle. Okay, so this is eerily reminiscent of what the M64 one. All right, there we are, We're back of the pack. I was looking at the gamepad. Um, oh, Windy Koopa! This is awesome. So far, so oh, baby Luigi's. Good and the Goombas are on the track, an unknown hazard. Um, this, like I said, I have never raced here, so if I do something insanely stupid or fly off the edge of the track, you'll know why. It's because I've never been here. I think this is the one featured on the game's cover, uh, based on what I'm seeing here, and it is awesome. This is so cool. Oh, yeah, man. Like I said, I mean, you might think I'm a dork. I mean, I'm not just, like, saying that. I'm genuinely excited. If I was not recording this game, I would be talking to myself. Maybe not talking to myself, but uh, I would be thinking in my head, this is freaking awesome. And, I yes, I would be up at 4 a.m. doing that, too. Whoa. <laughs> All right, so I guess that was the complete lap now. Uh, this is a sweet, sweet track. I don't know if you could, like, maybe drop off at Peach's Castle as a shortcut or something. So far, this guy is impressing me, you know. Granted, that can all change with a well, or I guess ill-advised blue shell from somewhere. 
kind of getting better with this control setup. I just, I still, when I've used the Wii mode for so long sideways, I'm still not quite like set with the, you know, like analog stick thing. Oh no. And in Mario Kart Wii, what was cool, you could dodge the red shells, green sh well, red shells mainly, and green shells when it was like a direct path, but you could use like the track and natural obstacles to kind of take care of that for you. Um, I will have to have a learning curve here to see if that's possible for me. I also don't understand the proximity just yet. We got lucky when I threw that banana peel. We did catch the red shell that was coming. Uh, there may be a learning curve there as well. I probably want to use this mushroom when we get hit with something. We'll save it. I kind of like to hold items when possible. I wish this game... The, my controls just did that thing where they got really weird. But, um... I can, what was I going to say it was important? I wish there was like an inset box you could turn on and off. Maybe like in the top middle, it was a rear view mirror. I think that would have been a really nice addition. And we're going to coast to the moon. Would have sucked if we like struck that top of the banner and uh, fell down and baby Luigi blew by us. That said, check it out, Koopaling's in the house. We got first, Ludwig and Wendy carried out fourth and fifth. Um, looks like Baby Luigi and Mario are going to be who we want to keep an eye on. But, uh, so far, Mr. Lemmy, so good. Alright, we're going to go on to the next race. Again, from this point forward, these brand new cups, not new cups, but, you know, the top line of cups, I have not played these tracks at all, so. Toad Harbor, here we go. I think this one was at E3 last year. I remember watching people play it. While I was in line to get my picture. This is a sweet looking track. Check out the boats. Uh, it looks like Princess Peach, but the dress looks Rosalina colors. Okay, so that could have been a shortcut right there with the cones. This is almost like a Delfino. Uh, there are some ramps we probably could have taken. Um, this feels a little bit like a Delfino Square. Or was it Plaza? I know one was Battle and one was not. That um, I shouldn't hit other Koopas. True story, uh, at work I ordered parts from a guy named Ludwig, uh, which I did not anticipate that happening. Uh, it's an American company, so. Uh, not a common name in this country. Here's a zero gravity we can check out. Oh, I did not know there were going to be ramps there. Do the trolley cars have ramps on them? We will investigate that at some point. Looks like this one has a lot of alleyways and back roads you can kind of take. So that's a complete lap. The sailboats are wicked cool. Wario, Mario, Luigi, I'm assuming the pink one would be Peach. Ah, I missed that little one there again. Let's just stay down this time in case we hit it on the final one. This is almost like a Shy Guy Bazaar type setup. And there comes the light. And this time I'll take the top path here. Uh, again, just in case on the final lap we wind up there, we kind of have like a feel for it. This is a drastically different course. Oh, this is nice. Oh no. Curse you, blue shell. Alright, so this is where those rows intersect. There's a spinning toad sign that looks straight out of the 50s. Uh, we took that zero uh, G one last time. We're just going to spin it this way. I didn't want a chance going for those question blocks when there was something just ahead of it. Okay, I did not see a ramp on the trolley car, so I don't know if you can land them or not. What is this way? Ooh, a nice little coin bonus area. That'll be a nice little shortcut to kind of rocket your way around at the end. Uh, 
I don't know, I'm thinking you might can cut through there, but I am not sure. We're gonna take this thing this time around. I can see that going terribly wrong if you, like, get hit with an item uh, when you're above the water. But, uh, pretty cool stuff here. I mean, I see elements of several tracks. So, a lot, I mean, there's a lot of stuff for me to take in here. All the toads lining the streets on the rooftops. Uh, this is definitely Toad Harbor. Uh, there's Wario's bus, driven by Koopa Troopa. That's reassuring. Oh jeez, and we lost coins too. I thought since we bumped the side, we would. So that zero gravity strip runs across that whole pathway there. Let me see. I should be able to get these two coins. We'll spin out this way. This path here would actually be desirable um, if you got a trolley there. You know. So there we go. Toad Harbor, pretty cool track. Oh, Ludwig right there behind us this time, so. Uh, that said, we got a dead heat behind us there. Ludwig, Baby Luigi, and Mario all within striking distance. Wendy representing well uh, for the Koopalings. Alright, next race. This game is so awesome. Again, very 90-ish, early 90s. Ooh, sweet. This is like uh, Luigi's Mansion crossed with a Bowser's Castle type thing. And I have a feeling I'm going to run into that bone fin. This is a cool look. Uh, Pac-Man World Rally had a haunted track that I absolutely love. This is very much akin to that. Check out Boo opening the doors. This is too cool, man. So again, I mean, when, you, when you're a veteran of the series, you pick up on a lot of elements. This is freaky, doing the zero gravity uh, and being on your side. That looked like a shortcut through a library. Uh, pardon me while I go off the track. I am taking in some seriously awesome scenery here. Um, my nephew's going to freak when he sees this. It's gonna, this is so neat, man. All right, so there's Bonefin up there. Not as big a problem as I thought they'd be. Luckily, I timed that one okay. I'm kind of getting the feel for this. Guess I can't get up there. Whoa, that's a funky angle. Can we land it up top? Yes, we can. And we're greeted by a blue shield. So fabulous. Okay, I'm gonna have to work on my backing up strategy. That's something I always did in Mario Kart. We, that's cool. The little night guards. I'm expecting, as I went through there, I was fully expecting the ground to fracture. I can't see anything. But I was expecting the ground to fracture and lava bubbles to appear. This is really hard to drive straight on. It's probably just in part I haven't been on it, you know, much. But let's see what's in here. Wait, which way do we go now? I'll assume this way. So that's kind of confusing. Alright, let's try to hit this zero G, but I don't know where the entry point is. I know I'm not drifting, I'm like studying the wall. Okay, we're gonna go this way this time. Now things are upright. <laughs> okay. Pretty cool stuff here, gotta say. Okay, I'm assuming we don't want to hit those guys. I don't know how I landed that. We crashed into the curb. Um, things not going very well here, but uh, they are at least going. That looked like a shortcut right there. Then again, that grass, I don't know if that was grass or pavement. Uh, we're just going to stick to this. <laughs> If we win here, I feel like we should win the cup. I don't know that we'd three-star anything. If we bomb, like, the next track or something. But, I feel like this will be the way to go. Now, I'm not going to take that shortcut. It kind of seems slow. Uh, so, we're just going to try to pick up two more coins, hopefully. Which will be hard with blooper in the mix. There's probably a blue shell coming for us sometime soon. See, I feel like I should have gotten that coin. Not that one, but I mean the one right prior to it. Um, 
I want to get one more whole thing. There's an easy one. Where's the finish line at exactly? Obviously, you know, if I was like farther back in the race, which will happen eventually, um, you get more power ups and everything. So. Oh no, 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 not here, not now. Jeez, that was, that's like the worst place. I, we barely beat Ludwig. I wish they gave times because that would have to be like tenths of a second. Uh, I nearly backed up to get the other two coins, and I'm so glad that I didn't. Um, shame they don't give you the time there. Now, what happens if I push the plus button? I don't even know what that does. Uh, probably should not have... Oh, I favorited it. Okay, I think that's what that must be, is I favorited that. So, let's just next race. I saw that up there and I was like, what are they, have they like upped this to six stars somehow? I wasn't quite making sense. I remember now, I think in Mario Kart TV, uh, there was the option, you know, like the popular and favorites, and this is sweet. It's like, this is like Wario's gold mine meets Koopa Cape, but it's Shy Guy infested. Yeah, right, we gotta take out uh, Ludwig here. It's almost even had a, uh, oh no, <laughs> a uh, Wario's gold mine sound. He totally threw off my line right there. And for that, he must pay. Cool rainbow. And of course, you do want to hit people in zero gravity. Uh, it will help you out immensely. This is very much like Koopa Cape. Uh, check out the water on the screen. That's really neat. Uh, I should probably go slower through here in case there's like broken tracks or something. But uh, this is a lot like an advanced version of Koopa K. I have no idea where we're going. Okay. Epic jump. Can we land that? No. I wonder what's up there. We're going to have to try and investigate that. Lots of areas to cascade off into Lakitu's loving hook. But, uh, Ten coins already, so this one seems coin heavy. Nothing wrong with that. Probably lots of shortcuts here, too. I'll start trying to comb the area for that stuff. And the thing is, the gamepad would show me right where Ludwig is. I just... I can't risk looking at it. That's the problem. Oh, no, 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 no. At least the red shell didn't double land us. I thought we were going to go off the track, and I was going to be an really angry little guy. I think this, if you can line up your jumps, you should be good. Obviously, you want to hit as many as you can when you're in tight corners. No, 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 hit the ramp, please. And the red shell came, and that is the absolute worst thing that could happen. And of course, Lakitu fished us the wrong way. Last time on the track, he fished me forward. So we've got some making up to do now. This will make things interesting for us at least. So we're third, we got Baby Mario and Ludwig in front of us. I think we can pull this off, barring we don't get decked with items. Fire flower, now we're getting good stuff. Screw you guys, we're taking your stuff. Shit, the fire flower went fast. I don't know if it's a time, the number of shit. He took all my coins. Alright, we gotta take this guy out. Oh, he has a banana peel. I thought he had a coin inside. Okay, that's where everything went terribly wrong for me. And we probably shouldn't go up here, but we just did. Okay, so that's all there is to it. I was thinking if that's like a long deal and I don't know where it goes, but we're up a creek. This is a kind of an intense action. Hopefully he's not drifting us. Got it. Alright. 
again, I wish there was a time frame there, but uh, 60 to 45, so uh, we managed to take him out. Not much change there. Waluigi kind of made a late run. Shy Guy didn't do well, ironically. Figured he'd be tough, tough on his home turf here. Maybe he doesn't work this area, who knows. But uh, that is that. That is a flower cup. So Pretty cool, if I don't say so myself. About 20 minutes right now. That'll work for us. I wish there was like some cheesy sounds with that animation. Alright, so here's some highlights for us. We're scooting, we're booting, we're going through Toad Harbor. And they cut it off right before we took that shortcut. <laughs> uh, well, of course, the, I know they don't show like our best highlights necessarily. Everything that's happening has been bad almost. They show Baby Peach hitting us with a blue shell. They show us getting struck by lightning. Man, tough crowd, tough crowd. Alright, that's a sweet trophy. I changed that one up. Three started, luckily, with Lemmy. We have unlocked the Star Cup, so that's cool. Unlocked a new character, must be a Koopling. Collected 250 coins, we've got a new vehicle customization option. Got a new stamp, would you like to post a Miiverse? I'll hold off just because you can't see me do that, and that kind of made an awkward pause for you last time. So, um, there we go. 50cc flower cup with Lemmy the Koopling, and we have perfected it with a three star ranking. Alright, so uh, we are done here. This is the run through on the flower cup. Um, you know what? Let me come back in here. Grand Prix. Okay, so they do actually do these in order. That means I'm going to go ahead and do all four across the top. Uh, so we'll come right back in on this screen. I'll make you wait to see who we unlocked. But uh, again, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoy this. I'm having a ton of fun. This is 100% blind now. I have not seen any of these tracks just like the four we just raced on. That was my first time pushing the pedal through those corners. Uh, and I had an absolute blast with it. Uh, Lemmy. Uh, served us very well, surprisingly, so that's kind of cool. It was neat to race as a coupling, too. Uh, I've never done that before. But, uh, as always, thank you for watching. Make sure you are subscribed. That will keep you up with all the latest, including this Mario Kart 8 blind playthrough. You can follow me on Twitter, like me on Facebook, circle me on Google+, whichever you prefer. Once again, thank you for watching, and I will catch you back as we advance to, I believe, the Star Cup, isn't it? Uh, I believe Star Cup and then Special Cup. So, nonetheless, we're going to advance to something and it should be fun. Stay tuned and I will catch you back here for just that.